Well, I didn't expect to do this type of video today. United Airlines invests 15 million in electric aviation startup, order 200 air taxis. You are wondering, Orlando, what the hell is an air taxi? Exactly what it sound like in major cities. They're aiming to have these, say, for example, Chicago or New York, where you can go rooftop to rooftop flying those. The price would be $100 to $200 for a ride instead of having to deal with traffic. Let me know in the comments if you would actually invest in you something like that. United Airlines is investing $15 million in EVE Air Mobility, an electric aviation startup owned by Brazilian aircraft manufacturer Ember. As part of the deal, United will purchase 200 EVE electric air taxis, which can seat four passengers and take off and land vertically like a helicopter. This is the second major investment from United on air mobility. They invested an undisclosed amount of money in Archer last year, which I will show you guys at the end, a video of Archer. These companies propose to develop small electric vertical takeoff and landing aircraft that can fly from rooftop to rooftop in a dense city as a taxi. But so far, none has received clearance from federal aviation regulators to fly passengers. This I give my thoughts in a second but eve may have to meet certain benchmarks before fulfilling its order with united as the airline described it as a conditional purchase agreement that basically mean once y'all sign some deals and actually get approved to do this we will pay you guys 15 million or y'all will have to pay us back this is the problem yo this is the problem number one this will take minimum five years to clear. Number two, air traffic control is probably not even going to allow this to happen because it's too many accidents. It's so many things that can go wrong and you got planes. So I guess planes don't fly that low unless they're about to land. I just don't see it really happening. They said they're expected to do it in 2026. Let me know your honest opinion. Do you guys believe or see it happening? Now here go um, Archer Aviation, a quick one minute video to give you guys an example of how it is. Archer Aviation just landed a big deal from United Airlines, a $10 million prepayment for 100 EVTOL aircraft. You'll see them flying now, right? We've got uh, pre-production aircraft out there being tested, but uh, still not quite ready for prime time. But I think uh, the, current, uh, the current timeline will be towards the end of next year. Uh, and again, uh, one thing that's great about Archer is from day one, it's been designed to be a commercially viable aircraft, which means the purpose of building this is to get it in the air with the payload, with a pilot, uh, and enough of a payload to do that. And so uh, we're thinking 2024, you know, the FAA and certification and all the safety aspects will be part of that. Uh, but uh, that's it. The cost is probably one of the best things. And again, all of that's to be determined, but generally it'll be roughly the cost of an Uber black card to the airport. Fair pricing is a broad topic and one that's a particular concern in the airline industry today given fuel. Uh, but at least at Archer, the team feels that making it accessible and putting in that average range of an Uber uh, is the same amount you would pay if indeed you were taking a car to the airport uh, in that particular case. If we can get you to airports in less than 10 minutes from almost any major uh, city to a major airport.